Welcome back, Commanders, to Let's Play Command & Conquer GDI Campaign. So, this is something new. We have three different options of where we can go next. Two for this area and one for this area. So, I'm going to call these uh, Mission 4A, 4B, and 4C. So, I'm going to do a video for each mission as uh, they are all different and I'll do them in order. So first up we're gonna do mission 4A. Which is uh, Poland. And I'm gonna to click to continue. Thanks to use by the United Nations, the Global Defense Initiative has one goal, eliminate multinational terrorism in an effort to preserve freedom. Brotherhood of Nod, an ancient and secret society, maintains strong ties with most global terrorist organizations. Commanded by this man, known only as Cain, Nod's long-term goals are unknown. However, recent activities include expansionary behavior in disenfranchised nations, high volume investment in global trade markets, and aggressive manipulation of international mass media. to be funded by Nod's access to vast Siberian deposits. Siberian continues to confound the scientific community, soaking up ground minerals and soil nutrients like a sponge. The result of this unique bleaching process creates the formation of titanium crystals, rich in precious metals and available for collection with a minimum of mining expense. Delta Sierra Echo to Commander, approaching our next objective. We're just crossing the Valeris border and we've got a problem. Nod ambushed one of our convoys and made off with a good supply of activated pellet rods. Sounds harmless, right? Well, those rods are step one in slapping together a nuclear device. We gotta get them back. Shepard's still offline, so we're acting without confirmation, but I'm betting that this is too important to wait. Take a small force into the Noddy camp and get those rods back before their birds can pick them up. The rods are packed in transport crates. I doubt Nod's had time to transfer them, but who knows? Keep your eyes open. Okay, so we have a new unit here, which is an APC. We'll just take out these guys. Okay, so an APC is a troop transport unit. You can uh, put infantry inside an APC. So left click on the infantry and then left click on the APC to load them. Need to make sure there's a bit of space. Now APCs um, seem to have more health or armor than a Humvee and they can also run over enemy troops. And the objective of this mission is not to kill all Nod. Uh, we, we just need to get to a crate which is holding some rods. So then once we get there, 
we can a helicopter will come and pick up the crate so I'm just gonna use the APC as they have more armor and I'm just gonna ignore the enemy units and just go through this mission and it's kind of like just go and get the crate and just ignore everything that tries to stop us because the only objective of this mission is to find that crate So we're just going to ignore the infantry or, or run them over if we're fortunate enough. There's the crate and we just need to get to that crate to uh, complete this mission. So that's mission complete quite quickly we got a high leadership because we only lost the one unit which was that APC at the end there and uh, efficiency 100% because uh, we didn't actually use any money that level I'm just gonna press enter to continue So we can see the GDI progression and the nod progression. And one thing about that video that we just watched, uh, they men mentioned in the video, the uh, presenter says that GDI attacked the town and, they, and uh, they're using, nods using that propaganda to turn everyone against GDI. but. Uh, actually in the next video which I'm going to do which is um, mission 4b we are going to see that town and uh, it will be our objective to protect that town it's actually Nord that's uh, attacking the town but uh, Kane is uh, instructing the news presenter to uh, misinform the public and say that it's GDI that's attacking the town so that's it for this video and uh, if you're enjoying this series uh, please support me by subscribing and uh, thank you for watching.